Hello guys and welcome back to another episode of Not My Bag. I'm George. And I'm Joe. And today we have Joe's biggest crush of Love Island. <laughs> it is Lachlan! <laughs> George! 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 <laughs> George. <laughs> he, he had that intro prep. Yeah, I had that prep and ready. That's smuggy. <laughs> <laughs> That's smuggy. Hello. <I'm> flattered. <laughs> Hi Lachlan. Wits in the background. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Very fun. Oh, yeah. Hi, we're... <laughs> <laughs> oh, so welcome. Talk Thank about you. Put me on Happy the fucking to be spot. here. Happy to be here. Thanks for having me, guys. No worries. Is this your first, po first podcast? First yeah. Podcast. It is. Bit indeed. of an exclusive. It is indeed. Ever? Yeah. Ever in your life? It, yeah, it is. <laughs> yeah. Losing your virginity not really, today. Not really, a, not really a podcast. I haven't, haven't, no, I haven't done it before. Well, first time for everything. I've learned that in the last couple of months. <laughs> but then me too. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? Oh my God. Are we speaking about the Not same you thing? you both losing your virginity. Mm. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> so um, oh. how's life been like just lately? Life's been just really lately? good. Yeah. Been, been with family. I think that it's obviously a weird one coming out and I mean, people. Coming out. C coming out of Love Island. Yeah. Just to clarify. Yeah. Come on, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> Joe was sitting there like, <laughs> come on over, Larkin. <laughs> Why am I this side? Um, <laughs> coming out of Love Island and see. <laughs> <laughs> Joe's ears like, <laughs> <laughs> this clip, Larkin <lock> gay. <laughs> you are moving like that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, funny. Coming out of Love Island yeah. and people kind of like recognizing you and it's definitely weird because I'm quite, I always say it, but I'm a very low key guy. I was happy, happy in my own life, but it's definitely a, it's a weird feeling, but it's definitely a nice feeling when, I mean, the reception that I've got coming out has been very positive. Yeah. I haven't seen the show, so I don't know how I've been kind of perceived, but from people coming up to me, it's been very positive. So yeah, well, I think you perceive really well, to be fair. Well, we all thought like, Joe can back me for this. We thought you and Whit were going to win really. Mm. Like, I think, I think the nation, I did, think the nation fair. did. Yeah. So yeah. like, what was that like when, Obviously, they called your name out, and you didn't win. But like, on I think I think you won like the people. You, you won. Something. You won the hearts. You won our hearts, honey. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, what was that like? Were you well, just happy for it to be over? Or like, honestly, for me, like I came in halfway through. I was Casa. I did not expect to meet someone and connect with someone, let alone be in the final. So even when Wit and I were in the final, we were just looking at each other like, huh? Mm, it's what? giving surprise. Yeah, like, we were generally like so clueless that. Well, people were backing us like that, but yeah, yeah, it was it was a nice feeling, but we it was it was almost like we kind of said to each other, it's like we don't feel kind of deserving of being here. So even when we when we were stood up with Jess and Sammy, when they got told they won, we almost were like ah, oh. because we we knew oh, we, we felt like if we won, they've been in from the start. Obviously, I think well, Sammy near you didn't know what was going to come off the back of it, sort of thing. No, yeah, and we actually in the villa were like kind of rooting for them as well, right? So. I mean, it was a nice feeling to be in the final. We were like, what the fuck? like, but it was definitely a weird, like, it wasn't like we were sad or shocked yeah. or there was no kind of emotion other than like happiness for them. Um, Where have they gone? Like, not even saying that to be muggy. I genuinely have not seen them. Yeah. Ibiza. Been oh, they're not Ibiza. Ibiza. Yeah, they've to been be fun, fair. Mate. Fair, fair. Fair enough. Closing. <laughs> I, love, I love that island. Closing, <laughs> isn't it? I love that, oh, island. that island. Special place in your heart. Very special place in my heart. What is that? <laughs> So, <laughs> I actually do want to know though, like what you did before Love Island, like job wise, yeah. what was, was the plan ever to go on Love Island? Like how did you get approached? Like all that side of that it. Does. Yeah. So I was an account manager before Love Island. So I worked for a digital marketing company in London Bridge. Smart. Smart. I like to say so. Smart. I like to say so. Corporate, uh, corporate baddie. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take that title. Corporate cool, um, baddie. Yeah, I was an account manager. Um, and Love Island was definitely not an easy decision for me. Like, yeah. I got I got approached, and I I found it quite. I was actually in the office when because I got I got a DM initially. It was like there's a single show, and I just thought, oh, it could be could be like a weekend job. You just quickly do something. Yeah, did not think it'd be Love Island. They were like, it's undateables. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okay. I'm, no, joking. I'm joking. <laughs> Sorry, I'm we're not joking. Sorry, Wit. Yeah, yeah Lachlan's like, no, no, no. <laughs> um, <laughs> no, oh. clearly not. But uh, <laughs> no, I was an account manager before. Um, they asked me to, it was a single show. It's Love Island. Are you interested? And initially I was just like laughing because I was with my colleagues and I was like, you'll never guess uh, Love Island have asked me to come and audition. But it was not. Like for me, I was battling between even doing the interview because I was happy, happy in my role. But you know what? My colleagues, my, well, I say family, 
my colleagues were very much like, listen, do the interview. Like you've got nothing to lose. Like be yourself. Mm. And you know, I was like, fuck it. Like, yeah, why not? Yeah. I don't want to look back and be like, I why, have done why didn't I do that? Yeah. So at least yeah, do, Cause I could do the interview and still essentially say, no, I don't want to do it still. Yeah. But I did it. I met the, the ITV execs and I left it and I was like, you know what? Like I've a hundred percent just been myself. So if they want me, they do. If they don't, I'm calm because I've just yeah. been there. I've not, because I feel like if you go to a plate, like if you go to audition for Love Island or any dating show, if you're trying to be someone that you're not. Yeah. You're going to get found out as well. Yeah. They'll see through it, I think. Exactly. So yeah. I, I was there, I was completely like, they were asking me, are you a fuck boy? A fuck boy? And I was like, no. Yeah. And so I was quite surprised when they were like, we want you on. Did you know you were going to go on as Casa? Or? No, this is another thing for me. Like they, they always told me when they initially told me I was going on, they were like early bombshell. And I was like, okay, cool. So they flew me out and I was quarantining for about two weeks. And you're like, get, liars. When, when, I first, <laughs> <you're a> liar. <laughs> when I first got there, they were like, oh, you're going to go in in a couple of days. Um, I'd be so on edge. Honestly. Like just waiting for them to come in your room one day and be like, right, you're going to And the thing is you're like, made to watch it every day. So it's like, you're there. Oh, you're watching it every day. So you kind of know what's going on that when you step in. That would me up, that would. The thing is you're made to watch it, but I was like, you know what? I don't even want to fucking watch it because it's just like, <laughs> You're so close to going on. You've, it's literally like a two month. Well, for me, it was a long, from when they kind of DM'd me. Yeah. To actually being there, it was a long process. It was maybe like two months. Really? Right? So then I'd, I'd, I'd been quarantining for two weeks and then one of the runners came and she was like, we got great news. <laughs> we know when you're going on, it's Casa. <laughs> <laughs> and I, went, I looked at her and I went, why are you telling me like this is good news? <laughs> yeah. I said, if you, if you told me Casa from the start, I, I would not, have done it. I wouldn't yeah. have done the show. But I also I, quarantining. Like, co where is COVID yeah, now? What, you what are you What are you quarantining from? Do you know what I mean? Well, well, I, I mean, think because you're in a bubble, they have to be really careful. Oh, they, like, do they? Can't afford to have someone um, that's got COVID then go on and everyone get ill. Do they check you for STIs? Yeah. Do they? they check you for everything? Yeah. You have a bigger crazy. Thing. Yeah. Imagine not going on because you got syphilis or something. I'd be so embarrassed. <laughs> I'd be so embarrassed. Definitely not. <laughs> that's twice now today you've brought up syphilis. I thought you were going to say that's okay. twice. I was like, damn. <laughs> I am a that's survivor. <laughs> Baiting your brother. Yeah. Oh, uh, rude. Don't joke. If either of us had it right now. <laughs> roll the tape. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, roll the tape. <laughs> so did you, when you went into CASA, mm. did you back yourself? Like, because the thing is for me, and everyone says this, it's like, like a lot of people that go on Love Island go with this kind of cocky, like, you know what? I'm going to go in there, be this macho guy. I was like, mate, I'm going to go in there, be myself. I'm not going to come with like the loudest guy in the room energy. Mm. If I connect with someone, I do. Shout out. Hey, <laughs> shout out. <laughs> <laughs> but if I don't, I'm literally happy to go home. Like, so it was never, it was never pressure for me because I would have happily gone there for a couple of days and come home. Well, I feel um, like a lot of the Casa people, they go in there and they think like... They need it, to do the most. Yeah. And if I get kicked out, I can still try and make social media my job for like two months or something yeah. like that. With, I feel like with you, you were just happy. You had been happy yeah. to go back and yeah. do, no, exactly. do your... It's a little holiday really, isn't it? Exactly. Yeah. Free holiday. Do you see that guy that went, what was his name? He went in and had a girlfriend and she posted. It was so funny. Oh. Cody. Yeah. The girlfriend posted and was like, he told me he was on a work trip. Oh, really? I would have been fucking fuming, to be honest with you. Uh, yeah, that's bad. <laughs> I, the thing is for me, like, I don't even check social media. So I hear stories sometimes. I'm like, damn, I didn't know that. I feel like Wit and I were so, like, not involved. Yeah. I mean, we're involved in social media, but we don't check it like that. So we don't see Fine. all of the stuff that comes out about people. But, um, no, nah, I mean, I'm, I'm so happy I did it. Like, I'm, yeah. And I can look back and be like, yeah, I'm like, I got Wit. It was a really cool experience. But saying that, it's like, it's not a holiday. So did, did you before, when, you know, they said to you to watch it before you went in. So mm -hmm. did you have your eyes on Wit or anyone before? Or were you just like, I'm just going to go in with an open mind? Open mind. Oh, right. Okay. Yeah, it was a complete open mind. I think Wit's that... Like... <laughs> God. <laughs> God damn. I think for me, like, and I said this to Wit going in, is like, the girls in there obviously are attractive. But for me, I need to connect with someone on a deeper level. Yeah. Because you can all... You can go on Love Island and speak to attractive girls, but I was actually like, and people were so shocked, even my coworkers, I genuinely said, I'm not going in there for any other reason than to find someone like, yeah. I'm actually a relationship person. Like I've been in relationships most of my life and I, I, wanna, I can't fake anything. So I mm. needed to go and actually speak to everyone, get a vibe and yeah, got wits eyes. So how long were you in <laughs> Castle for? It's, like, uh, it's only like it's three, three, three or four days, isn't it? Yeah. Or was it longer than like four days, four or five, five days? days yeah. yeah. I think so. Yeah, four or five days. So did you think Whip was going to bring you back? Mm. Or were you like, I'm in an iron about it? Nah, I knew she'd bring it out. 
<laughs> Man knew from day one. He was confident. <laughs> no, to be fair, I didn't. I de- I, the thing is, and Wit and I both say this, in Casa, we both knew that there was a connection there, but it was still so early. Like it's, And we're both slow burners as well. So yeah. I think that anyone that kind of gets brought back from Casa, there's obviously a connection there. But for someone to be like head over heels, to me, that's just like... Oh, yeah, a lot uh, in like five days as well. Yeah, that's what I mean. Like it, And that's why when Wit and I got to the main villa, it was like things just went like... Yeah, boom. you guys played it really cool though, I think, because sometimes it's a bit icky when they're like, I love you so much, you're my boyfriend, like all this yeah. stuff. And I'm thinking, come on. It's been three days. Come on. I mean, me and, you were a bit, <laughs> two days. Me and George we're basically bit, wiped after a month of night. Yeah, people. we are a bit like that. I mean, yeah, but it's fair. Yeah, yeah. me slagging everyone off, but also doing that same thing. <laughs> what was like <laughs> <Yeah>. your <laughs> What was like your highlight of being in there? Would you say, or would you ha- do you even have any? Or yeah, definitely. I think the highlight, a hundred percent, was when our families came. Right, because I think the. That's um, a massive step. Yeah. to be fair, isn't it? And so, I think hmm. I was I was saying to wit this. I remember on that day feeling a bit like. Not annoyed at Wit, but what happened is Zach, Zach's mum and sister came on. And as soon as Wit saw like, oh shit, it's family day, her whole demeanor went boom. <laughs> and I was like, this is meant to be a happy day. Like why, why are you kind of yeah, yeah. sad? And to be fair, I'd be stressing a bit. It was, mm. o- it was only until she kind of explained later on in the day where I'm just like, well, why are you annoyed? Like, yeah, <laughs> we're meant yeah. to be happy. Like, but it was because obviously we weren't together at that point. And I think I didn't really think about that either as that she didn't really want to introduce someone to her, like mum, especially, who you're not in a relationship with. So yeah, that's, that's, which I do that actually fair, get. Yeah. When she explained that, I was like, yeah. fair enough. But I was like- I just feel like it is hard though when you're in there because for, as a viewer, you just- automatically put everyone together. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Like you might have not said love you or you might have not. Oh yeah, maybe you, you, like but, as a viewer, you view yeah, them as I like just a, view, a husband like, and wife almost. Yeah, yeah I'm it. like, okay, we're in locker together. Yeah. But like, obviously it's, yeah, it's so not, different for you guys. The thing is for me as well, like I knew, like I, even though we weren't together, it's like I knew that we were going to be like boyfriend and girlfriend. Yeah. Mm. It's like, I'm not going to rush things for the sake of the show. Just yeah, because yeah. you're on TV. Sort yeah, of thing. yeah, yeah, exactly. And it could have been quite, I could have quite easily said, well, do you want to be my, do you want to be my girlfriend then? Like before, but I was like, nah, like I'm doing things at my own pace. And I think Wit's the same as well. So yeah. if you wanted to do things at her. I think you were quite well suited in that way as well. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Like you both kind of didn't rush things. Yeah. Yeah. 100%. So 100%. in terms of getting to know each other as well, because we only see what it's like, it's, an, it's not oh, even an hour, is it really with the adverts? Is there any parts of, <laughs> shade. Fuck uh, yeah. So is there any like um, parts of getting to know each other that we didn't see that are like kind of memories that you have? Because Mm-hmm. We only see like the highlight reel, don't we? So I think it's hard for me to say because I didn't watch it. But when my mum came on, I yeah. was kind of cheeky. And I was like, so like, mum, how, how have I been perceived? And she was like, well, and you know, your mum's going to hit you. with yeah, yeah, yeah. And my mum's someone, she's so like, she'll say it how it is. And she's like, well, yeah, they're seeing the nice guy that you are, but they're not really seeing like the backbone you have. And I was like, fuck, <laughs> damn. Because I know in there that I stuck up for where I like, put the boys in there. Playing yeah. Well, and that obviously, I mean, I haven't watched it, but that. I feel like that wasn't really portrayed. It was kind of like nice guy, sit back. No, movie sure. night was a bit heated, wasn't it? Movie night. What happened? Movie night. When I swear you stuck up for wit, didn't you? When there was a bit of oh, the grafties. Yeah, grafties. yeah. Oh, that's it. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. I just that was a hot too. fucking mess. That episode. I have never ever in my whole life uh, on a TV show muted the TV when um, Mitch started to go off because oh, I was like, God. "This is one of the most uncomfortable watches." The most icky thing I've ever didn't seen. he like? Was he like fingers on lips? And I thought, "No, I can't watch." What with I can't him watch and Scott? This. Yeah, yeah. Each other. And Scott was saying, Wait "What the nation for?" The popcorn, just as a normal <laughs> like, enjoying the show. But. Yeah, I mean, there were some big characters in there, so I can imagine like. I would say that I'd be like that and take a back step, but I probably wouldn't. I'd probably rather everyone. I think as well with Love Island, like they want the drama. They like mm, they want. Yeah. They're going to showcase the people that are kind of having the arguments, mm. having the loud. And Wit and I's journey was smooth. Mm. Yeah, and I'm ga- I'm so happy about that because, I, for me, I always said to my family before going, and I was like, if I if I look sad, it's, I'm fine because I just I don't yeah. want my friends or family to watch it and feel like fuck. He's not enjoying himself. Yeah, but I feel like they could watch it and. I had such a sick time. Like it was literally the best yeah. experience. So I'm really glad that our journey wasn't turbulent at all. Yeah. So speaking of the drama, mm. Ella and Uzi, Casa, yeah. I want to know, what were your thoughts? What were my thoughts? So, well, I didn't know Ty at that point and I was really, really close. Oh to yeah, fuck, you didn't, I, did you? I, I obviously had seen Ty on TV and I, I actually liked like how Ty kind of held himself. I thought mm. that 
Uzi and Ella were were suited, and you could see that there was um, a vibe there. Yeah, but I think yeah, it was hard for me to kind of make a judgment on it. I was fresh. I just met Uzi. Yeah. I really liked Uzi. I was from a from a boy's perspective. I was like to him, you, "Well, we're in Casa together. You can't just not yeah do something. Like, <clears throat> we're all in Casa. Get mm. to know her." Um, and I always thought that, um, like I always said that I thought Ty would be loyal, but I thought he'd have fun. Yeah. But he obviously, he didn't have fun. I didn't think that she would bring Uzi back. Did you? Um, I, I didn't really know, to be honest. Yeah. It was quite, because the thing is, Ella and Uzi, in my opinion, it wasn't like all guns blazing, like, whoa, you can see there's some mad yeah. type of thing. So. I was, it wasn't like I was majorly surprised, but it wasn't like a total shock. Yeah, yeah. It was, they were just getting to know each other. Mm. Um, I don't know. You always wonder, don't you, if Ty wouldn't have been loyal, then would, do you know what I mean? Like, Ella have would carried Ella on. have carried on? You, ne you never know, yeah. do you? Mm. It's weird. The show's, so, the show's so fucked as well because it puts you in positions that like you would never have the in real life in front of a partner as well. Yeah. The worst thing was as well is like, I was, the, well, we were the first um, couple to walk into the villa and you could just sit. Fuck's sake, we're. <laughs> we're. Bones oh, on silent. I'm just <laughs> oh, 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 that was a love <laughs> island. How you think you're better than everyone? Yeah, she's like, oh, another brand deal come through. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Keep it stum over there. God, you changed. <laughs> yeah. oh. I thought you were humble. Smug. Uh, <laughs> smug. Oh God. Oh, what was even the question? I'm lost. Um, we were talking. <laughs> um, just talking about the uh, like that it puts you in positions that you'd never normally be in, like with that type of situation with the Ella and Uzi thing. Like, but you said you were saying you were first back in yeah, with. So Whit. I was first in, and I could like. Because obviously I hadn't met any of the boys and I know there was, it was quite a tense situation. So I was out of respect. I wanted to be serious because it was a serious day. Out of respect. Like, you wouldn't Walking be, in like... Yeah, no, no, you're no, just gassed no, to no, be there. Yeah. Not, not from that perspective, from, but from the perspective of people like Scott, who was like obviously nervous about whether Kat was recoupling. Yeah, you know, true. I, like I knew it was a tense situation. So I'm not... Even though I'm obviously really happy to be in there with Wit, you need to be mindful. Did you know any... Did you know all the couples? So like, did you know Ella and Uzi were coming back in? Yeah, I wouldn't have been able to keep my mouth shut. Yeah. I'd be pointing at Ty like. Well, the thing, the funny thing is, it was so funny because obviously everyone's super close of wit, so you could just see everyone staring at wit because they're trying like, to get tell us. So yeah, yeah. Like Scott was like, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like everyone was trying to get some sort of like, and I was just like, wit, look down. Just yeah, I know yeah. she's she just smiles. Yeah, mm. <laughs> but no. um, it was hard to hear Ty. Ty's speech was nice. Um, about Ella, so it was difficult, but listen, it all worked out. Oh, that was one, of, that was that, a hard that watch. Was, yeah. Sick episode. That was a hard watch, I can't Sick. lie. About like Love Island, just as a whole thing though, it's probably like one of the weirdest things that will ever happen, as in you just met Wit and then like you're sharing a bed with them and living oh, with yeah. them. Do you know what I mean? Like, because we've, we've spoke to like, all right, Joe. Sorry. We've spoke to like just people. Four. We've spoken to people who have been on the show before and joking about me for this and they were like, they'll never have a relationship like that relationship mm. because the way they met them and stuff like that. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Like you'll never ever get into a relationship again where you've, you just like live with that person. 100%. I don't know. Stranger things have happened. Okay. <laughs> that's, that's oh, normal. No, I'm not saying that you got, I'm just saying that like, no, I'm saying we both like, move pretty quick. I'm not trying to move. Actually, I say. Yeah, let's get. Let's turn this interview. I'll be the interview. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah. no, saying that I'd probably move in. No, the thing move. is for me, like I'm a slow burner. So, I think the fact that we did Love Island, things, as everyone mm. says, thank you. There you go. Things accelerated so much because you're with. <laughs> it might be a bit strong. <laughs> I'll be there. Yeah. <laughs> She's trying to get that ring. Um, Cartier. <laughs> yeah, the Cartier. <laughs> Wait, I keep getting lost. Um, Sorry, I'm um, moving in. Yeah, no. You no, no, but it's just, yeah. So when you're in Love Island, things are just massively accelerated because you're living with them. You're literally spending 24 hours a day with them. Like for me, I think Wit and I were boyfriend and girlfriend in maybe what? A month or two, month and a half of Your knowing each other. Uh, Tumbleweed. <laughs> what do you even know? Tumbleweed. She don't even know. <laughs> okay, but at least you. Wait, are. was this a month after the show? 
Uh, I think it was maybe a, a few weeks, but I think for me normally, Fine. like I would be getting to know a girl, like it takes me a while before yeah. I like, pop the question, like, because I want to make sure it's actually like... How did you do it? It was... <laughs> Prezos. <laughs> <laughs> I did it myself. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't, it wasn't, it wasn't right tiramisu. But I met, I met, no, I made with her favorite, um, her favorite meal, rigatoni bolognese. Ooh. Oh, what a guy. Of course. Because mm. and I think as well, Wit is someone that she's a bit like me. I think people expect like some grand gesture, but it was just nice. We're in my 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 house, I say house flat, and we just had a nice meal, candlelit meal, glass of red wine. Pop the question. Babes. babes. Yo, girl. Yo, babes. Come close. <laughs> Come close. I want to be wife in that. <laughs> Do you like your rigatoni? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to tiramisu now. Oh my God. Not the tiramisu. But that was not nice. It was nice. Um, so yeah, that's how I did it. Yeah, because when we speak to other Love Islanders, they say that also when because so, like some people have obviously split and then got back together as well because mm. they say that connection you build is so intense you'd never have that that's what i was else. saying yeah we've like, spoke to like yeah. old love island yeah and they've said they'd never ever have a connection like you'll that never meet else. someone again and it will take like double the amount of time to get to know yeah. someone all that stuff is crazy yeah who was like do you well i'm guessing you still have contact with people in yeah in the who's like your closest from um, the series, would you say? I'm closest to. I probably speak to Scott the most. I right. mean, we have a group chat, so we all kind King of. King of Love Island. Love Island Worldwide. <laughs> yeah, Mr. Guy, Scott yeah. Worldwide. Mr. Mr. Worldwide. Mr. Worldwide. That man, Worldwide. Is, on, that man <laughs> is on tour. That man is on tour. <laughs> but I feel like, um, yeah, I probably speak to Scott the most, even though he's here, there, and everywhere. I mean, we have a group chat, so we're all close, but like you said, we're all busy, we're all doing our yeah. thing. But Who's in the group chat? Um, oh. He's the only one that's not in the group chat. I mean, I can tell you who's in the group chat. It's, Uzi, me, Montel, Zach, Sammy. Who else is in there? Ty. Mitch? Mitch. <laughs> My <Ooh>. mind. <laughs> rough, rough track. Rough, yeah. Shit, yeah. Rough. So basically, the, the, the finalists and Montel and Uzi. Um, but then I've got a chat with the Casa Boys. Oh, okay, well. fine. Um, but that's going off. <laughs> 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 Fuck me. <laughs> oh, you're so joking. Oh, yeah, but I think it's like, <laughs> Hashtag lit. Oh, God. Yeah. yeah you, so boys, did you enjoy your three days? Oh, George. Sorry. Sorry. George. At least I got the jet two flight home. I saw a clip from one of them the other day and they were like, hi, I'm so and so from Love Island. And I just looked at the phone. I was like, that's so Honestly, the, when, when we got in, so when the boys, because obviously what you know before going into the villa, whether you're coming in or not. It's and so peaked that they've got to walk out I know, and see but everyone the thing and is leave. Like, you're still kind of like skeptical. So like, I remember Zach, I've been like, Zach, like, you never know. Like, they're changing everything around this year. Zach's like, well, you never know. The girls that um, don't get picked, they might be, we might do Casa with them. <laughs> uh, we were like, I think we were just, they were like hanging onto strings a little bit, just hoping. I was hoping for them as well. Yeah. I was close with them all and I wanted them to experience the, yeah. Because I feel like the Love Island experience really only happens. When you're in the villa. When you're in the main villa. Yeah. yeah. 100%. Because as well, Casa's very Different. Casa's like some shack in the middle of nowhere, isn't Casa's it? Casa's different as well because. So rude. <laughs> Do you know what? It's tiny though. Uh, it's yeah. tiny. People, even, even when my parents came to the main villa, they were like, "Is this all yeah?" Right? Joe said, I, Joe's visited. I went to the, the villa, villa before you guys went in. Mm. And, uh, <laughs> and, uh, yeah, and um, I saw that note under my bed. <laughs> Yeah. I just love you. <laughs> love you, Lock. <laughs> Here's my number. Me just fit with my WhatsApp thing. Um, yeah, no, and it's very small. And it's also, I couldn't get over how kind of sterile it feels with the like floor and the wood and everything. It, yeah. it felt a bit. Like a set. And the hideaway was really hot as well when I was in there. Well, we didn't experience the hideaway. Did, did you not? Know? No, didn't get didn't steamy in the hideaway. Get to see it, no. Even I got steamy in the hideaway. With who? With Grace. Oh. Yeah, mm -hmm. oh. well, that's for another. That's for another pod. Jesus <laughs> yeah, <Christ>. episode. <laughs> <laughs> what did you have? Like any? Obviously, you haven't watched it, so it's hard mm. for you to say. But any like bits of beef that you can just remember in your head that might have been aired, or like even with the boys, where like someone done something, and you were like, I don't really rate that because we you, they don't actually show a lot. Well, there was that, that yeah. beef that went mental, wasn't it? About um, the fight, the alleged fight. Do you remember? I didn't even. Hit, was this between Josh? No, it was. Weird. <laughs> I think it was like there was apparently a fight with like KD, Wit. Oh, you know what's oh, so funny? Catherine, again, maybe. Again, the Casa girls came off of, and went on to a podcast, didn't they? And they yeah. Were like, We've never security seen a fight like came security, security came in. Everyone was like, that's absolute bollocks. Wit. <laughs> <laughs> I actually, do you know what's funny? I remember in that moment just hearing bare screams and I was just in bed like, 
shut up i'm tired like i really i didn't even know what was going on in yeah i just remember screaming and like the vogue voice the voice of god yeah yeah you know (laughs) i know i watched he's he's done his research (laughs) but they're like we're gonna get security in and i'm just but the thing is as well like that you get hardly any sleep there and that was like you're going to bed and the birds are chirping like yeah we've heard that so many times because obviously the thing is the reason why like your eyes were so red i was like i had two hours sleep the recoupling (laughs) takes like hours and hours and hours doesn't it so all of a sudden it's like 4 a.m and you guys go into bed and you don't have any concept of time either do you no 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 concept of time fuck me up so bad honestly did the room smell and it was so hot as well did it smell because that many people in a room probably get used to it i can't lie why don't you sit and shit for long enough Uh, (laughs) (laughs) but no it was it was definitely messy i'll tell you that it was yeah oh also i heard a rumor that um, when the you girls got rumor, yeah. the last I three things why that's the whole a rumor. I'm sorry, it's the whole point of having a fucking podcast. That's all we're gonna do. Um, so basically, that when the girls go up to the terrace, the boys make the beds. Is that true? Yeah, mental because they're always so good. Funniest thing ever, where it's like one morning you're with Uzi and so and so, and you're always just sitting there like, so how was last? You like, can yeah. tell you the can producer so tell is you've like been told to say it. Yeah, like, it's, it's so more, funny it's from more us. Or you to get see. told like go off in this group and just talk about yeah. last night. But you can tell because it's like you going one by one. So like you're like Montel, how's you and Leo? Or like yeah. do you know what I mean? You're like Zach, how's? It's just like <laughs> we're always used to sit there and not give a fuck. You it's just so we you just have our glasses on, <laughs> and sat there like this, <laughs> <laughs> not caring like that. <laughs> like, <laughs> it was so funny, so funny. Um, what was your favourite like date or challenge uh, in the series? Oh, the yacht. The yacht. The yacht. Unbelievable. Oh, like, jealous. It was Imagine funny. if you got it was seasick, fu- though. It was funny as well because I remember Whit being like, I'm, I'm not really a lifestyle babe anymore. And then, and then, we, and then we, got, we got a text. It was like, Whitney, you're going on your yacht. And she stood up and <laughs> <laughs> I was like, you're a lifestyle babe, don't worry. She loves yeah, it. So, no, I just like my rigatonian chill. <laughs> <laughs> let's stay in, but let's get the yacht later. <laughs> She's got both in her. <laughs> That's good though, I like uh, that. Yeah, yeah, no, you need to But no, on. the yacht was incredible. Like it was just, Jealous. when we got there and we were just like, what? Like a 30 million pound yacht. Like, no. you know me, I'm a foodie. They were like lobster, all the fish platter. The thing is with these dates though, it's so hard because imagine like, it's me and Wit here. There's a camera guy. Yeah, here, here, there. Yeah. And you have like a really nice moment and a plane flies over and they're like, can you say that again? <sighs> Fuck oh, off. That's no a I'm, not, I'm, just, I'm like, I've just spat bars. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You're like, you're my babes. And then, <laughs> <laughs> say it again. You're like, Fuck. That is yeah. so annoying. That but, is so annoying. But still, it was an amazing day. Like that, I said, we said straight away, like, nothing can top that. Yeah. So, you know, at the end when you guys like stand up and kiss or whatever, would they be like kiss more passionately? More passion, more, more passion. energy, more passion. footwork. <laughs> <laughs> you just fucking. Woo-hoo. How many times? <laughs> um, e- I mean, did they? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this yeah. pod, this pod is so funny because in the <laughs> back it's just gonna we be like, uh huh. Like, I'm like, they said that. <laughs> we got the voice of God in the background. <laughs> Thing is, well, it's difficult because like. Obviously, you want to have a nice kiss, but imagine fucking thirty people, yeah. thirty camera crew there. And they're like, have a passionate kiss. And you're like, especially not drunk. I couldn't but do that in the, I bet there's some weird sound guy in the back. Like, yeah, <laughs> <"Dog."> <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> bit more lip smacking yeah, going okay. on one more time. Have a grab, have a grab, go on. <laughs> oh, that's horrible. They're like, Dave, <laughs> fuck off. <laughs> oh, that's horrible. Um, oh, well. Uh, carry on asking questions because I know all like juicy gossipy ones. I feel like we need yeah. to, I feel like we need to like balance it out. Um, okay. Have we had enough wholesomeness? Who didn't you like? I know. Okay, yeah, okay, you can ask that, Joe. <laughs> there was no one in the villa, honestly, and I know Wit always gets annoyed at me. She's like, "You just like everyone. You like you." And I was like, "But honestly, I can't." Wit on helium. <laughs> I can't. You like everyone. <laughs> Surely there was someone that there even was, like hoard cereal. Coming, coming, wrong. coming out. There was obviously the Josh comment about how he's. Like, I don't. I'm not buying the nice guy act. Um, Who's Josh? <laughs> <laughs> ah, Who's Josh? Like, he was. Uh, he He was like the. Oh, the Josh. guy we met. Oh, oh my god, I mean, come on. Joe, yeah. that was so rude. <laughs> George, then, if I can remember who it was. Okay. But the, the thing is to me, there was no bad blood at all. <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, yeah. I feel like you're just very chill though anyway, yeah. so you just I think people kind of brush think as well, like, I'm not an idiot as well. If someone did something that was bad enough for me to be like, oh. you're a prick, then I will have to say, say it. it. But yeah. honestly, because I feel like I am just a chill guy and a respectful guy that that gets reciprocated. Yeah. But that will also, Fair it annoys people when people are nice because they're like, because they don't have it in them. They're like, oh fuck, well he's too nice, isn't he? Do you know what yeah. I mean? That, that'll always be bound to happen. But mm. Is there anything in the villa that you regret 
or like nah, no, no regrets no regrets no, reg- no, no regrets, regrets. Yeah, you <laughs> no regrets <laughs> other than that tattoo but uh, nah, um, yeah no regrets and what do you think about which song in the in the <laughs> Not the uh, in the background. I got me and Benny in the lane. No, do you know what? It's so funny because my mum, I feel like is the only person to be like, should come around for dinner. She's like, Wait, that song is so empowering to women. <laughs> and she's what? like, so, I remember when the, when the song first came out, my mum was listening to it like a fucking, you know, one of them, like when you have first hear a song in the studio, where it's like playing it to my mum on like, before it's been officially released. And my mum's like, so empowering wit and I'm just em- like empowering she's <laughs> like you're empowering women and, you, yeah. and, and, and wit's like and wit's like you know what mum it is empowering <laughs> George, you can be a baddie and a lady but you know what it's funny like I think the song's funny I mean people rate it it went off that whole thing just went off for like what? we actually we, we did of... you a favour I think our TikTok together got what five mil views yeah you're welcome Boost the, <laughs> the invoice will be in the post <laughs> 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 no it was so it was so good it was what? so good <laughs> yeah. um, I wanted to go on to the topic of food as well mm. you're a huge foodie. I know you're a big I foodie um, in the villa did you ever cook for anyone or did you cook for it what's this the this is you? something that I'm sad about okay. I cook so much like, but I they cook. don't show it do they so yeah. like your lunches you have and all that they, they don't you cook air, a lot like, in the I, villa I, yeah and I should have known that before because I've watched Love Island and I'm like they never what eat. Do they eat? Yeah, yeah. But like being in there, I was like, I cooked for wit a lot. I cooked carb. Well, I say carbonara. I cooked like a fake carbonara. I cooked toasties. I mean, there's not a lot of. <laughs> Wits like toasties. Do you mean you love my toasties? <laughs> <laughs> you love your toasties. Thank you. Uh, oh, oh, that's a funny story. <laughs> uh, oh, no, go on. You got to say uh, it now. Uh, 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 <laughs> <laughs> Look at me getting permission. Um, <laughs> yeah. No, I remember Wait. like obviously Wit and I were very, very early into our relationship. And I just got into the villa and I feel like now people know me. Like I'm just like, for me, making food for people is like, I like to do it. Like if I'm. If I'm making someone a toasty, it would be funny. If I made someone a toasty, if I made what a toasty, the girls would swarm. Flock over, yeah. Like, and can you make me one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm like, six toasties down, yeah. <laughs> no wonder I can't chat to Wit because I'm just fucking <laughs> flipping toasties. Um, but I remember Wit was like, well, my toasty's not special anymore because you're just making it for every every fucking person. And then the <laughs> next day, she was like dishing them out to like everyone. And I was like, yeah, she's the one. She, yeah, yeah, she's the one. <laughs> so you are, oh, so you got like, Intimate over toasties. Yeah, of course. Mm. Gee, imagine how can you not over a cheesy? I can't have that because I will shit myself. But I'm really happy for you both. It's one way. <laughs> turn, turn zone down. We're in the mood. So you're you big foodie. Cooked in there because yeah. when you eat in there, you're not allowed to talk about the show or anything. Is that uh, right? Yeah, the boys and girls get separated. Oh, you know, eated food. Ew, really? So weird. And that's the thing as well. Like for me, it's like when you eat is like the time that you properly like speak to people, yeah. relax, like kind of switch off, but. Like for, for the producers, it's like they don't want to risk people kind of having chats about what's going on because they want that. Or I guess as well, like with what the What do you mic, talk about? Like, <laughs> what do you talk about? Because it's like... Chicken's really dry. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, these chips aren't seasoned. Yeah. Like, they, they bring in... Well, what's the food situation? Yeah, the they have to know. Oh, just imagine, yeah. So you wake up at midday and the first meal being like a roast dinner. Oh. With gr- like a roast beef. I That's mean, what we were doing in our I beef. I mean, though. we were doing this in our beef. Oh, you like that? But, I like so, that. <laughs> our first meal, we'd get up really late. We'd go to lunch, wouldn't we, in Ibiza? And mm. then it would literally be, yeah, Joe, like, Joe would have steak, like... See, I need a couscous cus cus and all this sort of stuff. Yeah, I'm like that. Is yeah, you and me deep in puss. I was on my own most days, eating alone. I was eating the steak alone. <laughs> You, uh, I don't know why you're acting like you saw the buffet, George. I saw my own buffet. That's disgusting. <laughs> that, is, that is absolutely <laughs> disgusting. <laughs> anyway. So you had caterers in and then you could like cook whatever. Like did mm. they did they like stock up the fridge or no? Just, no. The, I mean the fridge was stocked, so you had like you know literally all they had was cheese, ham, raspberries. It was funny because um everyone took the piss out of Scott because in the morning, the <laughs> first thing he'd eat is like a whole bar of white chocolate and down like a Diet Coke. That's fucking I'm terrible. sorry. Yeah, and we were like, Scott, are you okay? And That's, he's so ripped. That is Scott is so, so lean. I'm like that though, to be fair. I can eat so much shit. And what was your lunch today? An elf bar and a monster energy? Yes. <laughs> and a packet of hula hoops. And a Cadbury's, yeah. Nutrition. Yeah. <laughs> mm, healthy. I wouldn't think that from Scott, you know. Yeah, I know. Where did your love of cooking start, by the way? Do you know, like... I would say, because it's funny, I had this conversation with my family. I think it was at uni. The f- when I went to uni, I think that it's the first time you were kind of away from home. That's cook for yourself. Cook for yourself kind of experiment different recipes so yeah i'd say uni i mean my mum's an amazing cook so she's taught me a lot but it's only when i was kind of left home what's your favorite thing to cook 
Um, Sounds like you like to a bit of pasta. Yeah, I do. I do like pasta. I like sea. I love seafood. So I right. Seafood. Oh, I love seafood, seafood so much. Wait, doesn't like. Seafood, really. Wit doesn't like seafood. Uh, oh, really? Red flag. I know. Uh, Save you some. Cockroaches of the ocean. The queen has spoken. Oh, and their feet are. I was loving it. <laughs> um, yeah, no. I um, Me and George can't cook. Yeah. Have you got any tips? I've got you sorted. Don't worry. I watch, watch my YouTube. <laughs> plug it. Plug no, it. plug it. Plug no, it. So like, Wait, so you're doing a YouTube with like cooking tutorials? Is that what you're yeah, doing? Yeah. yeah. Banging. Yeah. Banging. So I cooked the other day um, scrambled egg on toast. Oh, I love scrambled egg. But really cooking those. The egg it? was dry. How how do you make egg dry? You've not watched Gordon Ramsay's tutorial, have you? Uh, see, no. I've seen that. I do put a bit of black pepper in it. I it was a bit creamy. I'm though. intolerant no. to eggs. Oh. And I can't have cream okay. or butter. Oh, oh right. So don't oh, listen to a fucking word. Think, he guess what right. I guess what I eat for breakfast every day. The same. One thing. guess. Yeah, but you've got to guess uh, it because it's really rogue. Is it oh, oh it's fishy. It's not oh mackerel. No, Hardy. tuna. I have tuna on toast every day. Tuna on toast. That's so I like terrible. fork it down on the bread. Yeah, but also, right, Joe does the sob story. I can't eat this, I can't eat that. We'll go to Mackey's. It'll have double cheeseburger, mozzarella dippers, muck flurry. <laughs> like, yeah, espresso martinis. You're, I'm pretty... Can't have caffeine. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Like, cheese, bring it on. <laughs> yeah. You're, you're just tapped. <laughs> we, I'm sorry. <laughs> we, we, went, we went skiing. Sorry, it's such a oh. side note, but we, <laughs> yeah, I know we went skiing saying. on this trip last year and we were in the... Alps of mm -hmm. some country, I don't know. France. And there was fondue for dinner. Oh. And honestly, the amount of cheese I ate was disgusting. Like, I literally was coming through my pores anyway. Next morning, me and we George were sharing this room. room. Oh. Oh, I thought, oh. I, I literally, I literally I, saw George with his earplugs and eye mask on. So I thought, I thought a bomb went off. I thought, perfect, I'm going to do it. When I came out, he's like up, dead up in bed. He's looking at me and he's like, what's going on? What was that? I was like, oh, do, wait, not, in mind, do not shower is, or go in there. there is, <laughs> like there is snow coming up to the window. So we can't even open the windows. Oh, I'm just stuck oh, in this like, let's hud bugs this motherfucker. He's I'm just so stuck <laughs> in the chalet with just some, oh, it's just horrible. Yeah, I just, oh. I know, I know. See, so if you've got any gluten free or dairy free recipes, hit me up. But then the funniest thing that we do is when we go out and they go, any allergies? Me and Joe always look I at each other and Joe go, goes, no, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> and looking at my man's across the table like <laughs> <laughs> it is so funny what's your oh. favourite meal favourite meals mm. oh so when you invite Wit and I for dinner I can cook you guys at that meal well I do oh. love a roast dinner we both I love a roast I do love a roast and I feel like I can actually eat a roast any time of the year like if mum was the thing is though mum gets so overdone though I feel like you need it like yeah. but we eat it once a month then. Yeah, yeah but we don't have we have once a week don't ask about what, what we're about to do me like no, we have it we, once a week I, sometimes twice we're not really home loads all the time so we mm. actually don't really have it that often and when like, mum does it it's oh, like a moment hot, isn't it? it's a moment it's made potato, with love it? yeah man or I love um, sushi or a pasta a good pasta I love a bit of steak I love a bit of steak. Oh, I like steak. It's not really a meal though, is it? Steak, chips, bit of red wine sauce. Ice. Can you cook? No. Bro, I literally said, I made scrambled egg and it Bro. was dry. Bro. On, on and off the heat. You got, that's what you got to do. Is that what you got to do? Yeah. No idea. Because it cooks quickly. I put, I put some pepper in it though. You know, a bit. See, I burnt oh, beans. Well done. Ting and that, you get me. <laughs> but I did toast and that. Do you remember when I burnt beans? Yes, Joe came home pissed once and had a whole thing of beans and he put it on the hottest setting. Not tuna. And then, and then, and then. <laughs> tuna and beans, elite combo. Just put it out there. That's In fun. the beans, in the beans. Oh, with cheese, with cheese. Joe, no, do you not remember that? When you made, he made the beans that he burnt, he put loads of cheese in. So they were like cheesy and beans. And spaghetti. And then no, put it in spaghetti and made his like, own carbonari pastry thing. It was fucked. Uh, so I'm just going <laughs> to. It was fucked. I'm just going to put this out there for anyone that struggles to cook like me. Heinz tins of ravioli spaghetti bolognese and the sausages it was spaghetti. He's doing videos. Yeah, you actually Teach me how to cook. Gonna do I'll that. come over. Next YouTube video. I'll see me old pal Jake <laughs> and we'll cook. Get a gourmet meal. Mate. I'm ready. I'm ready. Um... Yeah, <laughs> me. I'm ready. I'm ready. Let's do it. Okay. Do you guys want to play say it or shot it? Yeah, sure. You too. I'll host it because I'm driving. Oh no, I've only got questions for Lockin. Oh, you can pick questions for me if you want. So you're just trying to get me wasted, basically. Right. Okay, George. George you well. pick three for me. Right. I'm on your phone. I'll do the three for Lockin. Name your least favorite Islander or shot. Just shot. Oh, you're doing him. He's eyeing up this. <laughs> Mr. Nice Guy, come on. <laughs> oh, okay, right. Fakest couple or shot? <laughs> Having to think about all the couples. Look at look at it. I can't answer one. You don't have to. 
Okay. Biggest lie from an islander since coming out of the villa. Say it or show it. Mm. Or islanders in general. I would just say that in general, people were rooting for us to win it because no one was rooting for us to win in there. Right. Oh, really? Yeah. No. So there was a bit of like... Well, there was no one in there where it was evidently like, oh yeah, they're backing us to win. But I mean... Well, do you think they were saying They it. said that they did, basically. Did they? Well, out, from the outside perspective, they were all like, we're rooting for you, but what you're saying is... Oh, like, no, we did. Yeah, we didn't have that in the villa. Oh. oh juicy. We were up. Like, when we, when we were up stood as, at second place, like, well, yeah. Quite, it didn't feel like people were like, oh, they're worthy of it. Bombastic side eye. Oh, shit. Is that, is that? Ooh. That's tea. <laughs> tea. Oh. That's Look at her with the ad libs. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I could be a baddie and a lady in the background. <laughs> okay, you did really well. Two out of three. Right, Joe, I've got some for you. Right, okay, let me top him up. So, Joe, questions for you. Say it or shot it. Okay. What's the name of the guy you're seeing? Fuck you, oh. absolute little. <laughs> well, I knew he'd have to shot it. Yeah, I just wanted to see you shot one. You. The dog. And then this last one. Um, <laughs> what's one influencer you can't stand? Oh, fucking balls. I think I've got a drink with this. <gasps> do it. Do the work. Do the work. Daddy, do the work. <laughs> do the work, daddy. <laughs> daddy, do the work. Welcome back. Um, <laughs> we've, we've found. <laughs> We found he's not squeezed. We found someone way. walking around like, the studio. <laughs> this lady, this lady was lurking. Um, podcast ready, but um, he's back. Yeah, we wanted to <laughs> test, well, not test your relationship. That's a weird way to put it. Just ask you questions um, okay. about relationships. Just so, get like the real tea. Yeah, the okay. tea. The download. Yeah. Oh, you guys can't see it, but they're touching. <laughs> <laughs> Lift it out. Mom and dad. <laughs> um, so biggest icks. That you've recognised since leaving the villa, or even in the villa, what's, what's yeah, going on? Say. I feel like you're going to be so nice. I'll say. Even <laughs> 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 I'll let her start. Then we'll battle me up. I'll say. Um, I'll be like, my I'm biggest like, issue is like, locking is so messy. Oh really? That, that you don't even mess up. I'm not that from a chef. You know, they're messy. I'm not. Right? Okay. Is it because you're like super clean? And tidy. Would, that's yeah. <laughs> very clean. She's very clean. <laughs> yeah, mine's messy. What's yours? Uh, no hicks. Next question. <laughs> 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 yeah, I'm perfect. Yeah. Moving on. No hicks. <laughs> Go on. What's your ick? Be honest here. Ick. I've never heard it, by the way, because mm. this is a first. <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking you got something to say. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> the, fact, the fact that it's hard to is like, a good thing. Maybe that you're you're quite a jealous person. I think. Oh, no, I'm not jealous. <laughs> he just doesn't see that girls are crafty. Right. He doesn't see it. You don't He's just see like, the... it's nice. It's a nice thing to do. I'm like, no. Like, <laughs> right. Oh, so okay. I'm not jealous. He's just right. Right. very nice. So you're saying like if... If he's at an event, or you're both at an event, and someone's like, okay, I'll go an example. We, we we can cut if you don't like. What what Where, is that? So Wait, she, so just she, say the name. No, no, no. And then no, I'll no, know. No. <laughs> no. It's like, if I hug, because I'm like quite. I'm, oh, the I, hug. Let, let me let's uh, let's do this. So <laughs> if I hug someone, and let's say like it's someone I know, I'm gonna be like this. I'm gonna be like, oh, I can't see you. <laughs> She's like. No. <laughs> no you, you, you tap <laughs> and you and I'm like <laughs> tap, <laughs> but what? Would you not tap? I, 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 I tap. I'm what? like you just tap their back and call it a day. Like, it's a lot, it's you ain't gotta like embrace them. Okay, I, like you, he will squeeze. I mean, oh my and God. Then, <laughs> I mean, locking titties to chest is just I don't know. Do you know what I mean, like no, we're there for so long. I I get it, but I've never thought of it as that deep. Like I do I'm get like, what you mean. I, but I probably, like, do you know what? If it's, like, it's like a friend that I've known for like years and years, it's not yeah. one of that. It's not a tap. It's, it's just like, oh, it's good to see you. But no, you can hug, but then tap, tap. Okay. You know what I mean? I'm, yeah. I'm a tap tapper at events now. To be fair, yeah. whenever, you don't know where people have yeah, been. Yeah, but if someone Honestly, you've known for years. Fine. Whenever I hug someone at an event anyway, like not, most of the time, obviously the girls and stuff are wearing makeup anyway. So I'm just a bit like an air hug. I'm like, I don't really want their makeup on me anyway. Right. Oh, that's even better. We've upgraded air hug. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. Sorry. So sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I was so <laughs> you're just making a no, weird. I'm weird. Like, like, air hug. 20 year olds are air hugging. Air like, air you have hug. no business. <laughs> <laughs> I've really just fucked it with you. Like, <laughs> no. Yeah. Yeah. You, get, you get what I mean. No, I get it. I, get I, yeah, I just think if I saw my man full chest on chest. <laughs> Hit a patter. I don't know. My I didn't, heart. I didn't, okay, <laughs> fine. Right. So, <laughs> I, okay. Yeah, that's funny anyway. Okay. <laughs> so, habits. worst habits for each other. Sorry, look at the mic, Sarno. We need oh. like Britney headpieces, don't we? Oh. Um, um, worst habits. Worst kind of icky habit. as well. Kind of icky, yeah. I've got one. 
Oh, you go first. Oh, this is so this is so that. weird. Every oh, time weird. I fa- every that time one. I FaceTime her, she's chewing cotton wool. Oh. Wait, what? <laughs> she chews. She chews. Wait, it's like it's gum. <laughs> she, she chews cotton wool. Babe, what? You know, you know, you see those yeah. people that enjoy babe, eating rock. I don't yeah. eat it. She, she no, enjoy it. do me like that. I no, she chew, it. She chews I cotton chew wool. It. I don't know. Gum? Extra gum? No. I, I don't like. I like the flavour of nothing. If that makes sense. Don't you look at like I'm one like, day? What are you chewing? Wool, and I was so like, it's like candy, but it's not. So it was very like intriguing to okay, me. Okay, I do want to try this now though. Oh, I babe, don't. You will never. It's all like I'm so worried it's going to be like a I'm trigger warning like, on you. So no one, oh, yeah, <laughs> there probably will be because in the villa, the producer will be like, Whitney, you're chewing again. <laughs> <laughs> That's why you get on with mum so much. Mum during Gogglebox used to sit there chewing Doritos. I'd be like, for the love of God. Yeah, Doritos. I love mum. Like cotton wool. That's so random. Wool. I mean, it's just like a, a just, it's I mean, also just like zero calories. Now, like subconscious. Yeah, it's like, <laughs> zero calories. Yeah. Zero calories. <laughs> no, I don't mind. Like, honestly, like, it's just a habit. Some people eat tissue, so I'm not that. Babe, bad. you're not far off. Like, <laughs> you're not. That's, 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 that's the next thing. I'm not like digesting it. Yeah, true, true. It's just like a. Do you know what I mean? That's a good one though, isn't it? I yeah, do, I do, crazy. I do chew cotton. That's like a well-known fact. I was not expecting to. No. Yeah. Because I'm, I'm so like, excited for your next Boots collab. Damn, <laughs> literally. You in the aisle. Really like, good one. Like, <laughs> yeah, it tastes really good. Yeah. Yeah. Whitney, we asked you to promote the micellar water. You're like... You're meant to use it on your face. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that is so weird. I can't weird. help it. What's, what's locks then? Can't. His, what, what is it again? What's the question? Annoying habits. Annoying habits. Annoying habits. Um, I've got another one. Oh my god! Oh. Well, damn! Are we on the rock? <laughs> like, no. can I say it? <laughs> Go and say it. He's got two. She, she wears she wears flip flops and she wears socks. Oh yeah, I do that. Do you guys do that? So what? So the crease of the yes. Oh yeah, that's the tongue one. But normally, I'd rather the sliders. Yeah, sliders and so, socks. The tongue right? ones are available. I just I'm a sock girl. I I'm, a yeah. I'm a so sock boy. Yeah, I'm a sock boy. No, yeah, 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 I get it. Sock I will yeah. never yeah. bend. Not when your toes anything. are doing this. Yeah, yeah. if your toes are in your shoe, we will never bend for any shoe. Never. I'm not saying barefoot a shoe, but I know what Locke's saying. Like. If you've got a sock on, and then the thing is, like, don't and this is why down your This is why it took me so long to ask her. If you're a sock, <laughs> <if you're, laughs> <laughs> he was just like, every time I was asking, he was looking villa, down. It's like, so funny, like I would do it in the villa. <laughs> Everyone would be like, "What are you doing?" Ever. If the sock girls it. get it, they get it. Yeah. If they don't, they don't. don't. Yeah. Straight up, I'm a sock girl. What's mine for you? Um. Is it X again? No, it's like bad habits, no, 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 basically. Habit habit. Bad habits, which could yeah. come under X, really. Yeah. It's like Bad snoring, no, he farting. Snore. He doesn't really fart. Do you not? No. God, you're just so I'm nice. Just so dream dream man. He's so gentleman like. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I don't have any like wow. I actually don't. So you he never like you. Does I he know. clean? Damn. What? Does he clean? Does it cling? C- clean. No, he doesn't does he clean. clean. I do he's clean. literally So that's a bad habit. Messy. Like I'm I would not. say he's messy. Like he is. That could be a bad habit, like leaving it his is. dirty shit. But how messy is be, messy? Right, this like, is not dirty. Oh, I've got a good right. one. So this is a question oh, to you guys. Oh, 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 for us, that's right. right. I'm about to right. say right. again. Yeah, I'm full fucking Another one, thank you. Stay with your partners, yeah. You you cooked uh, you cooked the meal. Oh, here we go. Oh, yeah. here we go. Oh, oh, wait, what he knows already. Is it who washes up? Yeah. Um, but I'm just like, if you're going to cook for me, you're taking from my experience. If I've got to go wet my hands. Like, why? This is my podcast. True. Were you silent or were you silent? No, okay, so <laughs> I'm <laughs> silent. Then <laughs> <laughs> um, it's not that you expect it, but it's a nice thing. Okay, so the other night, um you've never cooked. No, no, so the other night I got she cooked <laughs> so okay, so the other night she cooked for me, so I okay. washed up. And then the other George, morning I all, cooked breakfast and she washed up. Okay, with all due respect, you, you are me. so whipped. You no. are so whipped. If, if that yeah, woman exactly. if that woman said jump off the roof of pussy, I? you would have done it. That's what it's given. Yeah. Like, it's given. <laughs> like, like, fuck this <laughs> side. Yeah. If you, if fuck yeah, you this side. on that side, as in fuck this, this side. You know, really enabled like, that, uh, <laughs> Joe. <laughs> Don't make me start. <laughs> no, but honestly, I just feel like if I'm washing plates <laughs> yeah. after someone's cooked for me, it takes away from that's the nice gesture. That's just a nice gesture. thing to do. Mm. Yeah, but I wouldn't yeah. mind doing it on my own accord. But he'll like, you're washing up. I'll be like, oh. <laughs> he'll, he'll tell me I'm washing up. And it's like, 
since you said it, no, the fuck I'm not. Right. So, like, I, so I'm the same as you. I'd rather do a nice gesture off my own accord. If someone then said to me, well, oh, like if someone was like, oh, no. like who's doing the washing up? Ha, ha, no, no, I'd be no, like, that oh. didn't happen. No, I just thought I'd do <laughs> it. This. Yeah, but I didn't get the opportunity and the chance to think, yeah, let me, it was already. Uh, George, this is not comparable. Like, you bought the woman a Cartier ring. Like this is so not comparable. And then I would wash up to. <laughs> 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 Here you go. Uh, <laughs> if we're talking Kai, oh. give me the glass. So I got it. You were that. <laughs> oh, you're that girl. Uh, Lifestyle. Interesting. That's so, funny. so the next question is: Does it annoy you how long wit takes to get ready? No. Do you know, oh, what, do you know what is that, that rumor uh, true? My man, my man. Only because it's a rumor. Is the rumor true? Yeah, apparently in the villa oh. you were in the shower for like some days, like an oh, hour and a half. Shower, an not hour. an hour and a half. No, no, it hour? takes me like 30, 40 minutes to like shower. In, no, 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 no. Not oh, in the shower. villa, but yeah, in like yeah. real life. In the oh. shower. Your water bill must be dirty because it's like, why would you not scrub Bro, Your water all bill must be crazy. And that was going to be like, I'm weird. Cost of living crisis. She doesn't shower enough, but getting ready. Yeah. But for me, it's like, when I know she's going to take it ages, I'll just be like, I'm going to go to the gym. Oh, yeah. fine. Because yeah. I, can just, I can just plan it. It's, it's nice for me. I'll be like, all right, get ready, take that. That is hours. crazy, though, that you can go to the gym, <laughs> walk back, play a bit of Xbox or something, and we're still getting ready. Yeah. yeah. That's mad. I, no, I that, don't though. mind, though, because yeah. normally I'd be like, oh, hurry up. But if I plan it, because I know what she's like, yeah, that's fair. I'll plan it. So I'll but only yeah. for my makeup. Like, say, it took me like an hour to get ready. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Well done, I mean, look, I mean, I'm not the just. Carbs. Yeah, stamp on the carbs, mama. <laughs> <laughs> kind of prize. Uh. Oh, I can't. I can't. So yeah, funny. do you know what? I take a long time to get ready as a guy, though, to be fair. How long, How do, long you do you take? I'd say I can an get hour, ready. hour and a half. Yeah, that's fine. I can get Is ready. That I, no, that's not a long time. So I, you clean yourself. I gel well. my eyebrows. Exactly. I, you and you look great. <laughs> I wasn't fishing. So I, I came. So I was late the other day. I got back at Joe's 20 past five. We had a car picking us up at quarter six. In 25 minutes, I got ready, showered, dressed, clean mm. my teeth, everything. 25 minutes. Yeah, I'm quick. You're not that quick looking. Zayom. He's literally not, he's not that quick. <laughs> I'll, he's take that quick. I'll take it. Oh, okay. But oh, you're, yeah. you're quick. I can be ready. Like I can quick. be ready like that. Okay. Next question. <laughs> um, what is the next question? Relationship since the villa. Everything good? Oh, wait, because you, oh. you guys haven't moved in together yet. No. no. Is, well, is that no, a God. <laughs> No, everyone expect what? No, yeah. I, like I just think it, people do expect it though. Like it probably isn't the best thing to I do. Mean, but Tasha people and do. Andrew took a while to move in. Yeah, together, yeah. Like they? people do obviously take a while and stuff. But you see the obligatory. Oh my god, we bought our first place together. Blah, but blah, you're blah, both, it's been like two months. You're so both London. Thing is for us as well. Yeah, it's like London. well for me yeah. anyway. It's like we know that we want that, but it's like the whole point of like when you start a relationship is. Oh. Uh, Cartier! <laughs> <laughs> you you enjoy you enjoy the process of having that time apart because you're gonna have your whole life yeah. with someone. And we've always said I'd rather just buy like our dream house instead than of just like rent in somewhere. The, say, yeah. 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 So That's cute. No, I feel like we're both in the same. We're place. like in longevity. I feel like there's life yeah. stages. Mm. There's a time to be everywhere. It's not a rash. No. Yeah. He's around the corner. Literally. Like, it's oh, really? Yeah. Him. That's so decent. That's really so good. it's not like a must. Yeah. We have to meet. Do you, do you spend like a lot of time with each other anyway? Or Yeah. 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 Or like yeah. every so day? Or? Not every day. No. We've been cutting down recently. <laughs> do you know that what it is? Do you know what it is? It's when we're together, we're so like... I'll get up in the morning. Like, I'm going to the gym. She's like, no, like, like, no I'm, not, I, I'm trying to be productive. <laughs> no, you know? I can so relate yeah, to this. Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, I'm, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm trying to get up. I had to get ready for this meeting this morning in 40 minutes because I had the whole like, please don't go. <laughs> And I'm like, so guys, me, it's like money or like, yeah. like I'm, I'm just like, please. I'm setting my alarm next morning, like 8 a.m. But you it's so easy when you're in a relationship for you to get a routine. Yeah. Oh, and just yeah, like so let easy. your partner consume you. Mm. So I feel like in terms of we're in a good we're in a good routine. Better, like, yeah, yeah, we're in the a thing good is routine. We still like stay around each other's house like three days a week. Like we still see yeah. each other a lot. But I think it's quite healthy to have like 
Which I, I, like to, it's kind of like yeah. to start to miss seven days a week. No, I'm actually not. No, so but like, this is giving longevity. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I feel like setting those boundaries. Feel like the people. Why are you looking intense. at me like that? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, no, I saw her yesterday, <laughs> and I'm gonna see her Saturday. No. He's like this. He's like, it's <laughs> giving longevity. <laughs> I just, I'm just good with eye contact. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> you um, fucking dick. No, 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 no. Oh, sorry, I really didn't. Why mean, are I you promise. triggered? Yeah, he's like, he's like. I feel he's like he's giving insecurity. It's giving triggers. Oh. This is like mean girl table at school. <laughs> yeah. I, me, I, the mean fear, I fear for me and Whitney going out for dinner. Oh, oh, yeah. I fear it's you all. We're like new besties. Oh, I fear for it all. Oh. Lock in. When you're over there, lock them like, you and like, yeah. you know, yeah. we're up. Giving yeah. daily mouth. <laughs> Yeah, it's giving we're going to get in trouble. <laughs> I'm, like, I'm sorry, I'm sorry about these. Yeah, we're like, we don't know these <laughs> people. No, no. Oh, don't. I'm putting enough Fenty powder on. I'm fucking <laughs> sweating these pecanis out right now. Oh, um, yeah. so plans for the future in terms of like general what's going on at the minute. Tell us more about your, your plans ring. post Love Island. Ring. She's thinking about ring. I'm just trying to, obviously for me. <laughs> cook some pasta. Yeah. yeah. Some I just want to cook. Honestly, like no, the, the cooking is obviously Wit and I's journey separate. Like that's going Yeah, we're well, very much I different. Think we're both also very kind of focused on doing what we both love, like trying to- Enjoying make, it. Trying to, yeah, mm -hmm. just trying to make the most- But individually, it. like yeah. I need to be me. He's going to be him. For them to get by. Exactly. Like, posh and Bex. Yeah. What's Posh and Bex? Like, like Victoria. Oh, Beckham. oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, so do you know both, what I mean? We We're both, not trying to merge. We no, both no, no. We have our own thing going, but at the same time, it's like, together as well but yeah, that's yeah. Cute. I think yeah. we're doing everything right to be honest yeah. I like we're doing I say get that OK magazine front cover um, <laughs> I say put a ring on it bombastic like that mm. put a ring on it I yeah. say put a ring on it Harry Bear uh, oh I was thinking babe, the thing I'm is. not lifestyle but damn <laughs> 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 and on that note I'm not lifestyle but damn thank you both so much um, well thank you Locken well thanks Locken thanks Locken <laughs> and then you stealing the shirt no we had a we had a we had a Whitney as the ad libs through the yeah, whole thing. thank you bro yeah. we appreciate it it's man. been a pleasure oh, your first pod laddie. can I just that feel is, like oh for oh, fuck oh, 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 I'm never jealous, watching this again jealous is that too much why would you do that <laughs> um, and thanks Whit for, for ad living and Bob. <laughs> thanks for being a cameo. I love you. I love you. Uh, I love you. <laughs> air, air hug. Air hug. Yeah, air, air hug. Uh. Air hug. <laughs> Thank you guys at home so much for watching. Um, if you're watching on YouTube, oh my god, I forgot. I always forget. Make sure to Shout like. Shout out my YouTube. I just started it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Shout like, out period. to Whitney and Locker's YouTube separately. If you want cooking, if you want on baddie, the screen below. On the yeah. screen below. Tap. Um, How make, they do it. Links Tap. in bio <laughs> and, <laughs> and comment your biggest icks. <laughs> guys if you're also listening on Spotify please write us five stars it helps us immensely yeah, um, oh, shout out you guys shout out <laughs> to the gang but yeah all links will be down below and that is us for this week thank you so much and we'll Goodbye. see you next week bye 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 bye, bye.